Today I wanted to talk about a new Facebook feature called Facebook Partner Categories. And this feature is available for anyone who runs Facebook ads. So let's quickly talk about Facebook ads. You know, they work really well at attracting fans and potential customers to your Facebook page. But a lot of times they aren't attracting the right people. You know, Facebook ads for the most part are targeting, you know, the more general aspect, you know, what information people have shared on Facebook. Well, what Facebook partner categories are, are there a way to target people based off of information that data providers have about them that they do off of Facebook? And so how do you get Facebook partner categories? For starters, you need to be running Power Editor and this is a tool that's only available through Google Chrome. So once you have Power Editor running, all you have to do is go create a Facebook ad. And to do that, you just go to facebook.com slash ads. And once you've created your ad or started creating it, you want to go to the audience section. And here you're going to be able to specify a country, an age, a gender, precise interest, connections, friends of connections. But there's now a new section called partner categories under the category section. And as I mentioned, this is going to pull data about people on the things they do off of Facebook, which means if you've ever filled out any of the surveys at the mall, you're going to probably have some of this information pulled into that or even possibly some of your household questionnaires that have been passed around. So, the data that Facebook's pulling here, it's provided by Axiom, DataLogix, and Epsilon. At the time of this video, I only have access to DataLogix and Epsilon, but you'll pretty much get the idea of how this works. So when you are creating an ad, when you get to the partner category section now, you have a couple of options here. So if I select DataLogix, I can actually go in, for instance, and target people based on the type of car they drive. Do they drive you know, a new vehicle, do they drive an old vehicle? What model, what make? So I can actually go in and target this. I can also though target something that's really fascinating, CPGs, consumer purchase goods. I can target things such as cereal buyers, 33.4 million people, people who buy eggs, or even people who buy carbonated beverages. Now, if I skip down to Epsilon data, it's very similar. But this time, I'm actually targeting demographic data. These are people that have you know, specified their profession. Uh, that is one thing, by the way, I want to stress. This doesn't pull any specific user information. It just gives you uh, a better way to target certain customers. So let's quickly talk about uh, an example of how you would use this. So if I want to target, for example, soda makers, because you know I have my own carbonated beverage. I can target carbonated beverages. And if I want to target then maybe a specific profession, maybe say teachers, because I know that teachers are probably going to be the people that buy my product, I can now be a lot more specific with my Facebook ads that I'm creating. And so that's pretty much it, guys. That's Facebook partner categories. I think it's pretty amazing. I mean, there's like 500 plus categories here uh, to be able to choose from. And I think that it's really going to help improve the quality of your Facebook ads you're running. And also it's going to help you focus on reaching the right customers as opposed to just reaching people you're not interested in or people who really aren't interested in your product. So if you have any questions about this, you want to just you know talk about it more, feel free to send me a message. As always, thanks for watching.